When you take pictures with your camera trap, the pictures will be saved with a file name that does not indicate the location the picture was taken or on what date. Renaming your pictures to include location and date of picture makes evaluating your pictures simpler. The following video explains how to use, step by step, the free to download renamer software that will allow you to add a custom date to your images. The process is as follows. Firstly, copy all the files on the camera to a new folder on your computer. Name the folder to include the location and date in the folder name. In this case, the folder is called Myland Westgate underscore 22 dash 10 dash 2020. If you have not done so already, download the renamer software from this website. Install it, then open it on your computer. This is the first screen you will see. Notice the large window labeled Drag your files here. Open File Explorer in another window and open the folder you created with the pictures you copied from your camera. Select all the files in this window and drag them into the Drag your files here box. If you are asked by Renamer to validate the files, you can select No. Then ensure the files in the Renamer window are sorted in numerical order. To do this, Click the triangle icon next to the column called Name. In this example, we will rename all files from IMG to become myland underscore westgate underscore 22 10 2020. Each picture will keep the sequence number the camera added to its original file name. The next step is to create a rule to auto-rename all your files. Left-click in the window labelled, click here to add rule. In the window that appears, choose replace from the options provided. Rules can be saved for later reuse, as you will see. The window will now update. In the find field box, type in the common name the camera used to originally name the files. In this case, it is IMG underscore. In the Replace field, add a location and date relevant to the pictures you are processing. In this example, we use the format MyLand underscore Westgate underscore 22-10-2020. Now select Add Rule. Now click Rename to rename all the picture file names. This button is located top right of your screen. The rename will now auto-process all your pictures in one batch. If any pictures do not show as OK, repeat the process of renaming again. When the rename completes, a message box will appear indicating the number of files renamed. In this case, 922 files. Notice the original sequence number is unchanged for each file. Select OK to close this window then select all the rows of results and delete these rows as they are no longer required. In File Explorer, if you open the folder you created in the first step of the process, you will see all the files renamed. For later renaming of files, you can save the rule you created here for reuse. To save the rule we created in the example, click on the Presets menu at the top of the screen and select Save As. You will be prompted to name the preset. In this example, it has been saved as myland underscore westgate. Once saved, to use this preset at a later date, load your pictures into Renamer as usual. Then select Load from the preset menu. Select the rule you want to use. You may have created more than one rule as you have a variety of camera trap locations. We select the preset rule myland underscore westgate which we saved earlier. When the rule loads, now highlight the rule by double clicking it and when the menu opens, select edit rule. Overtype the old date to be the date when these new photos were recovered from the camera. Here 22-10-2020 becomes 03-04-2021. Now select 
save rule. By adding new photos to the large drag your files here window, these files will be renamed by hitting the rename button as usual. In this case, the files will be renamed to be myland underscore westgate underscore 03 dash 04 dash 2021, followed by the unique picture number the camera supplied. You can create as many rules for as many locations as you have chosen to deploy cameras.